welcome to my channel. Today I am filming something I have never really done before and I'm actually so excited to be doing. I've seen a lot of people do this trend. I will be recreating Mark from NCT's IG photos and looks. Mark is my favorite member of NCT 127. I have a huge crush on him. He's so cute. I chose some looks that I really like from his Instagram and also just like photo shoots in general that he's done in the past and I will be recreating them on a budget slash finding things that I already have in my closet. I thought that's what this would just be a really fun idea to get out of my comfort zone a bit and just try something new. So I hope you guys enjoy. For all the new viewers that might not know who I am, hi, I'm Steph. I go to Parsons School of Design. I'm graduating next month and I study communication design and photography. And I love making YouTube videos in my free time. So if you like this video or you want to watch more content like this, please, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. It would mean a lot to me. Let's get started with the first look. I have been researching photos of Mark and his fashion style. So what I can conclude from his Instagram and just like seeing what he wears. I feel like he wears a lot of darker colors, olive greens, dark browns, dark denim. He also wears a lot of expensive clothes, a lot of street wear. He still has like a really cute boyish vibe. I love dressing girly, but I also love street wear. So I like to combine the two a lot. You can see me wear or always like brighter colors, pink, pastels, like whites. So when I like looked at his Instagram, I was like kind of nervous because I was like, I don't have a lot of these things in my closet. So I had to go back to the archives and I had to actually go shopping for a bit. Honestly, it made the process a lot more fun and interesting because I don't really wear a lot of clothes like this. I'm recreating this photo from Instagram. He's wearing a green hoodie and black skinny jeans and it's a, he's also wearing like a cap. He looks so cute. But I thought that's this would be really simple to create because I have some of the things already and the background seems like it's in an indoor setting so I can kind of just set up my apartment the way it is and maybe use a little self timer. So in the photo, Mark is wearing a baseball cap. He's only showing the brim but it seems to be black or navy so I have my Yankee MoMA collab cap also has black skinny jeans that he's also wearing he has holes in his but i don't really wear jeans with holes so the next best thing that i could find are my trusty calvin klein black skinny jeans lastly i went shopping specifically for this video and because i had like no dark sweatshirts or anything like that i went and i picked up this extra large men's green Hoodie. This was actually like the last one they had from the men's hoodie section and it was also on sale This actually retails for a hundred dollars, but I got it for $29.99 It's up like the brim so that only the brim is showing <laughs> I look so sus right now. I look like I'm about to like rob a bank So in the photo, it looks like he's in like a living room like a plant here light some lights and like another couch You'd be surprised. I've been living in this apartment for like six months and I still don't have a couch. All right, this is currently my setup. It's such a mess, but it's fun, kind of funny. I got my ring light here, my iPhone on a tripod, my background setup, and here I have the reference photo to look at, and then I got my mirror here so I can see what I'm doing. like 5 30 i've been shooting all day i think i got it though let me show you guys what i have i took so many photos holy crap and i'm sweating because it's so hot it's pretty similar i'm proud of myself holy crap this is this is spot on man i Seriously, it took so many photos. For an Instagram photo, I'm realizing how much work actually goes into it because I'm coordinating an outfit, I'm also making the backdrop, and I also have to get the lighting right and everything, all for just three shots. But I'm just glad I finally got the first look done. This is what the first look looks like. Hello, 
so it is now like 6 30 the sun is still super bright outside i decided that i want to shoot the second look today as well just to get it over with i feel like i'm just on this grind and I'm already switched into the second look but I have to wait until the sun sets because this look is actually indoors and it requires flash the second look that I'll be doing is actually not from Mark's Instagram but it's a photo shoot that he did with NCT Dream that I'm just obsessed with like I love the aesthetic of the shoot I love how the photos come out and his whole outfit and it's just the vibe it is pretty much like still very dark colors he's wearing like a black long sleeves a lot of silver jewelry and i really just love this one shot of him balancing the football on his head I'm sitting down like in front of the door i think this is pretty easy to recreate but let me show you guys my outfit real quick i'm wearing a silver ring that i got in taiwan i have a brown one here right now i'm wearing extra large long black long sleeve from um, the streetwear brand called Steady that I used to work at and I got it a few years ago. These olive green cargo pants that are actually meant from the men's section at Uniqlo that I just also picked up specifically for this video like this morning. I'm wearing a belt right now to hold it up because they're pretty big on me. I'm really surprised because they fit me like height wise they fit me like perfectly so we'll see like how I feel after this. This is the most like dark colors I like ever wear. In the photos, he's actually wearing a long sleeve with like blue graphics and he has blue hair, but I feel like this actually works out pretty much because my hair is red and this is red too. So it's just like a little bit of my own style to it. I'm also wearing earrings here. These are just silver cuffs that I bought in Taiwan. Nothing too special. He's also wearing cuffs in the photo. And lastly, I got the prop. This is just a standard football I picked up from Target. Let's wait until the sun sets and then start the shoot. Okay, vlogging this on my phone because I'm using my camera to shoot these photos. Since I'm using flash and technically what the original photo was, was um, a photo shoot. So I just want to make it a little more quality and I'll just show you guys the setup for this one. I switched the necklace to this one. I'll probably just Photoshop it to make it silver, but yeah, I think this is a pretty accurate outfit. So I'm gonna put my reference photo here. I got my really janky setup of a tripod. I'm gonna be sitting right here. Currently shooting this still, it's like, dark now and this is taking forever because getting the right shot actually takes so much strategic planning and i'm like going insane because it's so hard to keep pressing the timer while still trying to get the pose and i don't know how mark freaking looks good every time but i don't know how to like match the facial expression he's doing because i just look so dumb um, yeah, let me show you guys how I'm shooting it. Okay, it's close to 10 p.m. now. I'm still shooting. I took so long trying to get this one photo right. It was really hard because I had to balance a football on my head, but I think I got the shot. Today is Friday, April 29th. I took a bit of time off from shooting um, the looks for this video because I just got so busy with work. I needed time to like style everything and get the clothes put together But I feel like it's worth it because I got the perfect outfit for this shot So for the third look of Mark's Instagram I'm gonna be recreating this photo that he took at the park underneath this really pretty um, cherry blossom sakura tree. I think I got this photo pretty down to the T. I had to take a bit of time to like get everything, but I think I got it. So in this photo, Mark is wearing a dark denim jacket with a white t-shirt that has like red lettering on it. 
and I just actually got this Kith Cupid t-shirt so I felt like even though it's not the same, exact same it's not like cursive writing it's still like a really cute accent and like my kind of way of interpreting it in a, like a more girlier way He's wearing cream sweatpants from Essentials um, Essentials is too out of my price range but I got these cream sweatpants from Uniqlo they're a size small I think I got these for like 25 to 30 dollars I also got a, a dark denim jacket from Uniqlo I, this, this is a, a small in, in men's he's also wearing a navy beanie to match the jacket so I borrowed one from the office it's just this navy knit kith beanie Oh my god, this actually looks so cute. He doesn't really show the shoes very much in the photo, but he's wearing a pair of black Vans. I happen to have a platform Van sneakers that I haven't worn in a really long time, but I grabbed them. I have the Van sneakers. Okay, this is the finished look. Now I'm gonna head out for the afternoon to shoot the photo. I need to find basically a tree that looks exactly like his and in the photo though, it's cloudy. It's like the brightest sunny day out today. I don't want to keep waiting until it's a cloudy day and then shoot it because like I don't know how much longer these flowers are going to be out and blooming. I'm at the park now. It is so beautiful right now. Holy crap. Everything bloomed. So this is perfect. I'm thinking shooting under this tree. Also, while I was walking here, I picked up this mask. It's like the Korean face mask that they all wear, and it's the exact one that he's wearing in the photo. So, got this for like a dollar. I'm gonna wear it. It's actually so hot. I'm gonna put this mask on. been here since like two and it's like four now I'm really tired after taking so many photos so I think I'm just gonna sit and chill and read my book so yeah. last look that I will be shooting is this one from Mark's Instagram and he's wearing this all white outfit and he's standing in front of a pink wall if you're a fan of Mark you know that his favorite fruit is watermelon this look honestly I feel like was harder to, for me to recreate one I because um, I needed to find a pink wall and he's also wearing all yellow colored shoes which I don't own and it was just a hassle to look for I'm honestly thinking that this look will be more heavily photoshopped than the rest because I need to get a pink wall pink background and that's just really hard in general to find and I just don't have yellow shoes so I'm trying to make do with what I have so let me show you guys what I got for this outfit so in the photo Mark is wearing a white Henley top so I picked up this Henley top from Uniqlo in a size small from the men's section got this for $24.90 he's wearing white baggy denim pants he also has like chains like on the side over here where the pocket is I happen to have a silver chain that I will probably hang on the pants as well got this from Brandy Melville like super long ago so instead of all yellow shoes the next closest thing I have are these pair of Converse's that I just bought yesterday they're the Comme des Garçons um, heart Converse that like it's just a classic the color is beige but it's like the closest to a yellow like a, even like a light ye yellow that I can get Last but not least, I bought the most important accessory of this look, which are two watermelons from Target. Okay, I have to put them down because they're so heavy. But those were like the smallest watermelons I could find. The ones that Mark has in the 
photo are a lot smaller and cuter and like he's literally just holding them up with his hands I am definitely gonna be doing some weight lifts with these watermelons because they are freaking heavy Okay guys, I finished putting on the fit and I actually think it looks so freaking accurate I'm wearing the Henley tee My zipper is still broken but I feel like if I straighten it enough it will look fine for the photo I have my chain here I just finished the very last look Here are the photos side by side That is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is the first time I did something like this and I honestly really, really loved this whole concept and the whole process. If you guys want more content like this, please, please subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. Shout out to any N citizens watching this or any Mark Lee fans as well. That's really it and I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in the next video. Bye!